Welcome to our exploration of Hera, Queen of the Gods. We'll uncover her complex nature, from divine power to human-like emotions, and her pivotal role in Greek mythology. Let's begin by examining the essence of Hera's character, which sets the stage for understanding her influence in both divine and mortal realms. Hera, Queen of the Gods, epitomizes the intricate balance between celestial authority and mortal frailty. As the goddess of marriage and childbirth, she wields immense power over sacred unions and the miracle of life, demonstrating her far-reaching influence in both divine and human affairs. However, her notorious jealousy reveals a startling vulnerability, bridging the gap between immortal might and human fallibility. This fascinating dichotomy between Hera's godly status and her all-too-human emotions serves as a cornerstone of Greek mythology illustrating how even the most exalted deities are not immune to the passions that plague mortals. As we delve deeper into Hera's story, we'll explore her divine origins, which played a crucial role in shaping her destiny and defining her place among the Olympian pantheon. Hera's divine lineage is a tapestry of cosmic significance. Born to the titans Cronus and Rhea, she ascended to Olympian royalty through her strategic marriage to Zeus, a union that symbolized the harmonious merging of sky and earth. This celestial partnership elevated Hera to the status of queen of the gods, solidifying her influence over both the heavenly and earthly domains. Her dual role as goddess of marriage and childbirth extended her reach into every aspect of mortal life, from the joyous celebrations of weddings to the miraculous moments of birth. The Hariah festival in Argos, a grand celebration in her honor, not only paid homage to her divine status, but also reinforced her critical role as the protector of marital bonds in ancient Greek society. While Hera's divine status granted her immense power and reverence, it also set the stage for the intense emotions that would define many of her actions, particularly her legendary jealousy. Hera's jealousy burned with an intensity that rivaled the fires of Olympus itself, often manifesting in acts of divine retribution. The tale of Io vividly illustrates the depths of her wrath. When Zeus transformed his lover Io into a white heifer to conceal his infidelity, Hera's suspicion led her to demand custody of the animal. She then appointed Argus, the hundred-eyed giant, as its relentless guardian. This myth not only showcases Hera's cunning and power, but also highlights the paradoxical nature of her character, a goddess of marriage engaging in vengeful acts that seemingly contradict her divine domain. Such stories underscore the complex interplay between gods and mortals in Greek mythology, where divine emotions could have far-reaching consequences for humanity. Hera's jealousy, while often directed at Zeus's mortal lovers, found its most enduring target in Hercules, Zeus's demigod son. Hera's vendetta against Hercules stands as a testament to the enduring power of divine wrath. Her hatred for Zeus's illegitimate offspring fueled a relentless campaign of persecution that began with an attempted infanticide, sending venomous serpents to Hercules' crib. The hero's miraculous survival only stoked the flames of Hera's fury, leading to a lifetime of divine interference. She orchestrated the famous Twelve Labors, designed to be insurmountable challenges, and even induced a bout of madness that caused Hercules to commit the unthinkable act of slaying his own family. This tragic saga exemplifies how the emotions of the gods could profoundly impact mortal lives, blurring the boundaries between celestial power and personal vendettas. While Hera's influence often manifested in personal vendettas, her reach extended far beyond individual conflicts, shaping the course of epic battles and wars. Hera's involvement in mortal conflicts, particularly the Trojan War, demonstrates the far-reaching impact of divine politics on human affairs. Aligning herself with the Greeks, Hera's opposition to Paris's judgment, which had sparked the conflict, drove her to intervene repeatedly in the war's course. Her masterful manipulation of Zeus, as depicted in Book 14 of the Iliad, showcases her strategic brilliance. By seducing Zeus atop Mount Ida, Hera cleverly diverted his attention, allowing the Greeks to gain a crucial advantage on the battlefield. This episode vividly illustrates how the machinations of the gods could dramatically alter the fate of mortal warriors and entire civilizations. To truly understand Hera's essence and the scope of her divine influence, 
we must examine the symbols associated with her, each rich with meaning and significance. Hera's symbols offer profound insights into her divine nature and the extent of her influence. The majestic peacock, with its eyes adorning its resplendent tail, embodies Hera's all-seeing vigilance, particularly in matters of marital fidelity. The pomegranate, bursting with seeds, serves as a powerful representation of fertility and the abundant fruitfulness of marriage under Hera's domain. Her regal diadem, a crown symbolizing celestial authority, affirms her status as queen of the gods and her unparalleled influence over both Olympian and mortal realms. Together, these emblems paint a comprehensive picture of Hera's multifaceted identity as the guardian of matrimony and sovereign of the divine order. While Hera is often remembered for her jealousy and vengeance, her role in the epic tale of Jason and the Argonauts reveals unexpected depths to her character. Hera's pivotal role in the Argonautic quest unveils surprising facets of her divine personality. As Jason's celestial patron, she employed subtle manipulation to guide the expedition towards success, demonstrating a level of nurturing support that stands in stark contrast to her typical vengeful image. This portrayal challenges our preconceived notions, presenting Hera as a multi-dimensional goddess capable of both fierce retribution and compassionate guidance. The myth of Jason and the Argonauts thus expands our understanding of Hera, illustrating how her influence extends far beyond her traditional domains of marriage and childbirth, encompassing the realms of heroic quests and mortal ambitions. As we conclude our exploration of Hera, it's clear that her complex nature embodies the very essence of Greek mythology's intricate tapestry of divine and mortal interactions. Hera stands as a paragon of divine complexity in the annals of Greek mythology. Her roles as a fierce defender in the Gigantomachy and the steadfast protector of marriage underscore her commitment to maintaining cosmic order. Yet her display of profoundly human emotions adds layers of depth to her character. This duality profoundly influenced ancient Greek concepts of matrimony and femininity, reflecting societal expectations and the intricate dynamics of relationships. Hera's multifaceted nature, balancing her celestial responsibilities with deeply personal vendettas, continues to captivate modern audiences, offering profound insights into the eternal struggle between divine power and mortal feelings that lies at the heart of Greek cultural understanding.